Hi everyone, in this video I will share how to create a quarterfoil layout. Then we will draw a simple motif using the layout and then make a pattern, all in Procreate. So let's get started. If you google quarterfoil, you'll find many variations of the quarterfoil shape which was basically used in architectural monuments. I will use one of the most common shape to make my pattern. So to start with, I have taken a grid repeat or a full drop template here which is 3600 by 3600 pixel at 300 dpi. So first I will create the template and then draw the motifs. For the brush, I am taking the chalk brush from calligraphy section and for colors, I want a monochrome palette. So I will choose the purples from this palette. You can take any brush or colors of your choice. The quarterfoil shape usually has many variations but today we will use the most common one. Now first, I will tap on canvas, then toggle on drawing guide, tap on edit drawing guide, then go to symmetry and tap on radial symmetry and then tap done. Now start drawing a semicircle from the diagonal line like I am doing here and that's it. This is the template that I will be using today. You can also tap on fit to canvas to stretch it to the edges. Now we can also make another variation of this shape and to do that first duplicate this template once and make the original invisible then start drawing a line from the middle of the arc towards the diagonal guide like I am doing here and now erase the portion of the arc that is below the lines you just created and you will get a variation of the quarterfoil layout you can use any of these templates I'll give the links to download these templates for free in the description below this video. So I'll first decrease the opacity, keep it in multiply and create a new layer and don't forget to check if the drawing assist is on or not. I'll create few more layers before starting to draw. I'll then drag and drop a color for the background and now I'll take a color and start drawing from the center. You can follow along with me and draw exactly what I am drawing or you can choose your own motifs and doodles. Just go with your creativity and also use as many colors as you want. If you are following along and any shape is hard for you, then go with the teardrop shape like this or make one C curve and join it with another C curve like this. So I will continue drawing. Now with the monoline brush, I'll add some line details to add more interest. I'll now make another layer and outline the shape also. And later we can decide if we want to keep it or not. Now I'll group everything except the template, then duplicate the group once and make the original group invisible. And now I'll make the pattern using the pattern making template which I have shown in details how to create in these videos. So do watch these videos to understand the process. I feel there's some gap here so I'll quickly fill it up. And now we will test the pattern but first I'll toggle off the drawing guide, make the template invisible and now first I'll test it along with the layout outline and then without the outline. So with three fingers swipe down on the screen then tap on copy all and again swipe down with three fingers and tap on paste. Now duplicate the layer three more times 
tap on the first layer then tap on the blue dot on the top left corner and type the size that is half of your canvas size so in this case it's 1800 since my canvas is 3600 pixel so i'll repeat this step for all the four corners and now merge all the layers to see how the pattern is looking i'll again do the same steps but first make the outlines invisible now if we compare then i think it is looking much better without the outlines so this is our final pattern i hope you learned something new today don't forget to download the templates in the description below thank you so much for watching merry christmas to those of you who celebrates and happy holidays bye